Okay, guys. Um, <laughs> something I've just stumbled on, to be honest. It's not uh, something I've done before. I was just messing around. Because uh, I really didn't fancy trading this match. So I sat here, I'm thinking, what if, like you do? Um, and Sunderland decided to score. So what I did was thinking that's going to be a low price for uh, both teams to score. As you can see, £25 lay on both teams to score, yes, um, which was done uh, probably about four minutes ago, something like that, maybe five. Um, so as you can see, okay, it's not a great profit, I've only used a small stake there, but uh, we're seeing a little profit. And what I thought I'd do was, uh, in the correct score, obviously it's 1-0 at the moment to some Lent home team. Uh, Put some little bets in here, so I put uh, a total of uh, four pound. We're trying to get this as well, so just in case it went to two nil, obviously I'm not going to get that. Um, as you can see, I'm still in green on here because obviously these I've done the one apiece and I've done the one two as well. Um, if I did manage to get the two nil where I wanted it, then uh, it's like a, a little low risk thing. So I'm just just messing about with it. So. Say I put £2 in there, so my total is going to be £6 that I'm risking here. You see what I've oh, missed it. Sods a lot. Because I'm trying to do a video, but it's just a thought of this, and if uh, anybody wants to come back on me, I'm, uh, any thoughts? It's not going to get much, so I'm just for the sake of this video, I'll just stick £2 in here. Okay, so as you can see, it's 1-0 at the moment. Um, there we go. Which, so I've got six pound, uh, six pound risk there. So if it stayed at 1-0, I'm going to lose six pound, but I'm obviously going to win uh, 25. If it stayed at 1-0. Uh, Which it probably won't. Um, this is starting to go up nicely. Which is the idea behind this one. And obviously in the correct score. I'm covered if uh, if it goes to one apiece. Obviously not, not by very much, but that's not really the idea. Um, and the one two I'm covered on what uh, the initial outlay over there, which on the uh, correct score. I think the the amounts won't play in with. But uh, on the both teams to score my risk is a fiver basically but what I'm thinking is here is if uh, somebody scores early especially if it's the uh, not the favourite you're going to get a low price and get in there as quick as you can um, how far did it trade as low as we got as low as 1.17 which is pretty low so it's not a, not a big risk ok not, not gaining a lot here but as I say I'm just just stuck just stuck it in. I'm not. Uh, I think some figures need playing with, and I think you could make this pay. Um, so if it went to one apiece, I've got one two covered because Man City are favourites, but I haven't got the two one covered. But my idea is to make some money on the actual both teams to score market. Um, this should stay pretty stable, really. I mean, you're all the next. You're on both the next scores, so they're not going to go shooting up. In fact, as you can see, this one's more likely to come down because Man City are the favourites. So you could stop on here, um, tap 24, so you've got 24p profit there, and go back to the both teams to score, and depending when you decide to trade out, then you've got a profit, so, okay, it's not a great profit, but I'm only playing with sort of small figures here, I'm risking a fiver, it's not end of world, um, for that fiver risk, if you could get that up to, say, £2.50, it's like 2 to 1 on, you're going to win, um, and if somebody scores, okay, you've lost your fiver. Sorry, correct score. You've lost your fiver. Um, but I'm sure we can uh, manipulate these once a goal goes in, whichever way. I mean, ideally, Sunderland 2 0 would be nice. And then we're, we're still only risking £6 then, but we're, we're going to be in a greenish position or maybe just in red. Okay, just food for thought. Um, let me know. I'll see. see uh, See what you think about it.